Okay, I've just received my white duck 13 foot regatta bell tent. So I'm just going to unbox it and set it up and show you what it's like. So here's the box. This is the uh, olive green one. Let's see how we get on. Nice, oh, heavy duty canvas bag. Instructions. Nice uh, toolkit, I think, with the uh, pegs, I believe. Eggs, mallet, nice. So the poles, nice uh, sturdy bag with a waterproof bottom to it. The, uh, that's the front pole thinner and that's the middle pole with the uh, foot pad to stop it tearing through the, the uh, floor nicely wrapped very sturdy Very sturdy poles. And they've got a wide chain in the middle. Uh, that is really thick. I mean, that's gonna withstand a lot. God, they are heavy. Very nice. This is the front pole. With the uh, the waterproof cap that goes over the over the uh, tent, we'll get it off. We stop the rain coming in the hole. Okay, I have laid it out. Put instructions. Pegged all the outside down. Now I'm gonna insert the two poles and then put the guy ropes up Pole. 
There's a small hole in the top. So Pretty good tightness, a little metal pole there. Tighten those up. Get that straight and then I'll uh, make sure that it's best to do the zips up before you uh, fully check it out. Just make sure they're not too tight. Right, let's see. Okay. Tent is up. Uh, looking good. Got the, uh, the vents at the top, and around this side is the uh, stovepipe vent, which rolls up. Just have to cut the hole, which I'm going to do. I've got a, a uh, fire coming. As soon as I get there, I'll uh, cut the hole and show you guys again. Very sturdy tent. Got uh, windows on three sides, I think. Just looking, have a look inside. So we've got uh, Velcro on the zips on the outside. Very good zips, YKK zippers, very easy to, uh, not so easy to be one hand. Very easy to unzip. Three way zip on both. Uh, and these, these roll back with tyres at the side there, which I can't do at the moment. And we've got the mesh bug net inside um sorry about the video in very strong thick bug net so inside it's probably a bit dark let me uh let me wind this back okay i've got the drawers tied back now let's go inside very spacious uh, so you've got the hook at the top here to hang lights or whatever you want. Some vents at the top, very small vents, but I don't know if they do much actually. But uh, then you've got three windows. So there's your bug. They can roll up, and they've got bug nets on each one. Got some air in here. Air and a bit of light. Over here you have the uh, entry for uh, electrical cable. I'm going to use it for my solar panel uh, wires, which is great. I think it's got a flap on the outside to stop. Uh, water coming in. Got two, two of these pockets uh, either side for uh, storage of books, magazines, whatever. That's the inside of the stove jack. So fire's going to go down here. Uh, now I think there are there's actually little loopy things here uh, that you can hang lights or. You know, things from which is good. Uh, so, yeah, it's good. It's uh, the beauty outside. It looks like a good tent, and the floor is very, very, very thick. Um, I have lots of tents in my time, and this is a very thick uh, flooring. I'm actually going to put uh, a tarp 
under it uh, just as a double protection from stones or whatever but these uh, adjusters for the guy ropes are very good and metal um, adjusters very thick guy ropes and they're also anti-reflective for night time so you don't trip over the wires um, yeah just give you a brief go around the outside but so far it looks like it's going to be a good purchase this um, I believe I have to spray it down with a hose thoroughly and let it dry to uh, sort of make the pores of the canvas more watertight I believe so I'm just going to look at the instructions for that but yeah that's the 30 foot regatta belt end by Duck Duck white sorry not Duck Duck <laughs> white duck